Hi guys, so um, today I wanted to talk about some things that I had picked up yesterday. Okay, so recently I have just finished my Clarins Foaming Cleanser and I have been using that cleanser for I reckon at least two years I'd say. I reckon it's been about two years. So I wanted to try something different and um, I was having a look at the Clinique counter because they had a promotion on at the moment whereas if you spend over I think it's sixty dollars then you get a free gift so I always love the free gifts <laughs> so I went in there I had a look at their facial soap and I needed a toner as well so I picked up those two items so I picked up the yeah the liquid facial soap this is mild so here it is here Now, um, this one says it's um, for dry combination skin. I have combination skin, so, yeah, <sighs> my one. I wanted a sensitive, but they didn't really ha have a sensitive skin type. It was either dry or combination or very oily skin. So, the, the one thing I didn't really like about the um, Clinique is their variety they don't have a huge variety for the different types of skin types out there i found anyway so and i also was informed that clinique have like a three-step system and it's like you have to do the three-step system if you want results is the impression that i got so i picked up this cleanser and um I tried it last night. I've only used it once and I actually didn't mind it. It doesn't smell, it doesn't really have a strong smell to it. So I like that. So it's affordable. I think for this one, it was $29 and you get 200 mils of it. And this is going to last me a long, long time. I know because I literally put one pump in my hand and it just was definitely enough product to clean my face so it's a gel it doesn't really go foamy and um, soapy like a foaming cleanser but your skin still feels clean after using it so I don't mind it I'm interested to see how my skin goes with it so yeah so I picked up that $29 then I also picked up I asked for a toner so this one uh, I'm going to show you straight away because it's so huge it's 400 mils and it's called it's step two and it's the clarifying lotion this is also dry combination skin so there's the bottle there huge 400 mils and this was 52 dollars so that's a fair bit of money i didn't realize how much it was until she was like yeah <laughs> yeah adding it all up so um, I tried it last night as well after my cleanser. I didn't mind it. It doesn't have alcohol in it as far as I'm aware. I'm sure she said there's no alcohol in, well, actually it says right there alcohol. So she had told me there was no alcohol in the toner. I just looked at the ingredients and it says alcohol. So I don't know. <sighs> Anyways, let's move on. So it's comfortable non-drying exfoliator. Gently removes dull, dry flakes to uncover skin that's vibrant, glowing. Da -da 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 -da. Um, I did notice with this product it has menthol in it. Now I don't really have a problem with menthol. Um, I don't really have. I don't have a problem with fragrance either or anything like that. So my skin didn't react to it or anything like that it just felt very cool as you can as you can imagine you know products with menthol in them just sort of gives you that real sort of cold feeling on your face um, but it was funny because I had patches like it felt cold up here and it felt cold down here but in here it didn't feel cool or anything like that so that was a bit weird um, yeah so I picked up that I don't really like that there's alcohol in it, but I'm going to continue with it and see how it goes in comparison with my Clarins. 
So all up, I spent $81. I've got my receipt right there. Okay, so on to my free gift that I received. So we come in this little bag, and she just pretty much put the toner and the cleanser inside this bag too to make it look um, full, I guess, because it's not very full. Um, but I did get some good products in here. So I'm going to start with the creams that I got. So I got a Youth Night Moisturising Cream. As you can see, it was for dry combination skin again. Now, I received a sample of one of the Clinique night creams. It wasn't this particular night cream. It was a different one. Um, and I think it was in a glossy box that I actually got that in. And I loved it. I just loved, loved, loved it. It was a small little container, but it lasted me ages. And I just loved the smell of the cream. And this one has the exact same smell as the other one. It's just so creamy. And you only need a little bit and it goes really really far I used this last night and oh, I just love this cream I love the Clinique, Clinique night creams so I got that as a free gift and then I also got the um, the SPS 15 daily moisturizer so there's that one I haven't used this one yet just because I got up this morning, I took my daughter to school, and then um, I went straight to um, my friend's place. So I didn't bother putting any makeup on today or anything like that. So um, it has the same smell as the night cream, so I really like that. It looks so creamy and milky and just delicious. <laughs> um, yeah, so I got that. I'm very interested to try that, and I think I will enjoy this this one too because I like the night creams so I got those two in my gift I also got the seven day scrub cream rinse off formula so I got that and that's in let me see uh, 24 meals of that oh no sorry it's 30 meals what am I looking at Mm, something else so it's 30 meals um i haven't tried this one yet either just because um i wasn't ready for an exfoliator last night so i didn't i didn't bother um this i uh, let's see what it smells like not a strong smell i'm gonna put a little bit on my hand there like the tiniest little bit just to see how grainy it is um even though it says seven day scrub cream i wouldn't necessarily use it every single day just because um yeah i just don't feel the need to exfoliate every single day it's very very creamy i'm just rubbing it in my hand here it's very very creamy it's very gentle like really really gentle um i'm not too i don't really like the smell once it's on the skin yeah, it's, I can't even describe the smell. Very, very gentle. Leaves my skin actually quite soft. Definitely, uh, if you want to exfoliate every day, I would, just from that little patch there, I can tell that it's very, very suitable for every day of the week because it's just so gentle. Um, and the directions just say, massage gently over makeup-free skin. Rinse or tissue off. So I got that, and I just remembered I did actually get another product that I've left in the bathroom. I'll be back. Okay, so the other product I received was the Clinique Take the Day Off Makeup Remover for lids, lashes, and lips. So there's that there. So it's a bit hard to see, but it's just like a purple... I don't know if you can really see it's sort of clear at the top here and then it's very very cloudy looks like it's sort of oil half oil she told me that it wasn't an oil there's no oil in it she had told me she just said it just looks that way so I'm just having a look now for the ingredients 
and I can't actually see the ingredients on here. It's in a different language. So yeah, I received that and that's in a 50 mils. Now I tried this last night. You meant to shake it all up. Um, just pop it onto your you know your cleansing pad and obviously remove your makeup so I held it there I had a fair bit of mascara on yesterday um, or did I have the no I had the this mascara on and it was you know it looked like there was a lot of mascara on so I just held it there for about 10 seconds wiped away and it really did remove my eye makeup I was very very impressed with this very impressed um, I think this was just as good as my Bobbi Brown oil. So, um, you know, I really, really like that. And I probably would actually purchase that in the big size. So I got that. Then I got some makeup. So here we go. Just these items. I got a mascara. And this, I've just dropped one of the products. This is in number one, black, and it's the High Impact Mascara. So there we go. I'll show you the brush on it. And it's, this is just um, 3.5 mil. And I'm just going to roll my sleeves up a bit because I don't want to get mascara on it. So there's the brush. So probably definitely suited for my lashes. So I'm happy about that. And next time I put mascara on, which is obviously going to be tomorrow, I'm definitely going to try this one and review this mascara. Okay, then I also got a eyeliner. And this is the Quick Liner for Eyes Intense. And it's in number one, Intense Black. So I'll just... So there we go. And this one is the type of liner that you twist upwards. Like you, you turn it up. You turn it up. <laughs> the only problem is you once you wind it up, you can't wind it back down again. So that's one thing you've got to be careful of. Now I'm just actually looking at this. And can you see where the mascara, the eyeliner, sorry, actually ends in the tube? Can you see that? So if we're looking sort of, look at that, it's empty from there down. There's like a smidgen on the side. And I only just noticed that. So this obviously isn't going to last me very long. Um, I tested it out on my hand and it's very intense. It's very creamy, very smooth, and I'm really going to rub it and rub it. And I really have to rub it hard. So yeah, I really have to rub it to remove it. So I think it's definitely going to be a long lasting, um, eyeliner. So I got that and I'm guessing that's a full size as well looks full size it's um it doesn't actually say how much is in it but anyway you can see it's a good size so interested in trying that and then the last product that i received was their chubby stick so this is the chubby stick here Moisturising lip colour balm, as you can see, and there's the colour. So I haven't tried this yet. I've got a bit of baby lips on at the moment, so I'm just going to try and rub that off just a little. And let's try this now. And I think this is one that you twist up as well. Everything is falling off of my desk today. And <laughs> I seriously just got myself with eyeliner. Well, that's a whole lot of product wasted <laughs> on my hands. And I'm just going to wipe that off with whatever I have near me at the moment. Okay, so let's try this. And it's a nice, um, 
Oh, it's very smooth. It's very creamy. It's like a peachy. sort of color. I don't know if there's a huge difference. On camera that is, obviously it will look different in the mirror. But I got so I got that and that's um I don't know if this is full size. I haven't I don't I don't know because I haven't seen their full size one. The chubby stick, I've never tried the chubby stick before. So very happy um, to try that and very happy that I got it in my little case and I really like the color that it is too so such a pretty pretty color mm. so um, <laughs> yeah they're the free gifts that I got so that's a Clinique Clinique little haul um, for today um, yeah really really interested in trying more Clinique products and yeah i'm impressed so far with with what i have so once i use these products more i'll come back and do another review maybe in a, in a month's time just to see how my skin is going with it see if there's any improvements so i've got no makeup on today or anything like that so this is how my skin is starting um it left my skin very very soft very smooth felt very squeaky clean um didn't leave my skin feeling tight or anything like that even before i put on the night cream and my skin didn't feel tight or anything like that so that's good um and yeah so i guess we'll just have to see how clinic goes so thanks for watching guys and i will see you tomorrow